It's almost time for some very green shenanigans. And we need some lucky charms. And we're here with our own lucky charm, Ashley Morgan <laughs> from Unglued in downtown Fargo. And she's going to show us how to make some cute St. Patty's Day crafts for the kids and maybe a drink for an adult. But everyone can do something here. <laughs> you yes. got all ages covered today. <laughs> yeah. We do, yes. We're going to craft, eat, and drink today. And so you're going to start okay. with our little lucky shamrock plant. And so it's a cute little oh. gift oh, you could do. Adorable. It Love could that. be sent. And so I have a hot glue gun. We use this little heart punch and some ca green cardstock, or you could use green tissue to punch out some hearts. And I'm going to let you take over. Oh, gosh. You trust me with, <laughs> with the hot, our glue, hot glue Here we go. And you're basically going to hot glue three shamrock pieces together. Three so of it's them. three little hearts. Three little hearts. Okay. If you don't have a punch, that's fine. Here you can go. cut them by hand. They don't need to be even. They turn out really cute. And while you do that, I'm going to prep my clay. And so I have just normal oven-baked clay. I've already screwed it up. It hot glued to me. <laughs> yeah, oh, no. Yeah. We need a little first aid kit at the I end might, of this. I might. I might. Now I'm nervous and my hands are shaking. <laughs> it's totally cool. This proves you yeah, like really having your own kid here I didn't, yeah. to do this craft. <laughs> yeah. Mom, I need an adult. Yeah. Well, I think you're doing great. Okay, yeah. And it would, could be even better if we would have mixed our cocktail first. You I could drink I, that yeah. while you're crafting. People might think away. I already had it. <laughs> Yes. What I did was formed a ball of oven baked clay that we're not oven baking. It's just going to go in this adorable little terracotta pot. These are only 59 cents to buy at Joann's, like we were talking about. Yep. And we just want to fill it to be like our little dirt. And you're prepping those shamrocks really great. Thank you. If you look at this side of it, it looks better. Yeah, there's always a good side. Yeah, this is not the that <laughs> of side. All the things. Oh, that's not a good side. I don't know. <laughs> and then if you could put a big dollop of hot glue, and we're just going to add this piece of floral <laughs> Sorry, wire to I don't it. I'm a hot so mess over here right now. I'm getting hot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I yeah, just cool. want to say you're winning uh, okay. really hard right now. Okay. And so I'm going to put my floral wire. You don't need to use the fancy ah! stuff. <laughs> it's attached to me. <laughs> I swear, you... this isn't my first rodeo with a hot glue gun. I thought I was the my worst crafter. My mom crapper. did like, craft shows. Like, whenever everything wrong for the last touch, I'm like, I don't know how to make stuff. And now I feel like yeah, the professional like oh. yeah. compared to Jordan. Well, you made it. Oh, give me you a fan <laughs> someone. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Like, it looks great, oh. though. It was, it was stressful, but it looks good. Yes. yes, and then see? you shove it into your oven baked clay, and, and then you, you do are. like a couple more, and you've got this cute little lucky shamrock plant. Oh, so <laughs> you lucky. can add the word lucky to it if you want. I'm going to give you a break. I don't know <laughs> why I'm this. stressed out about this. <laughs> well, you're doing great. You need okay. to bring the doctor back. And you're going to play with candy, okay. and we're going to do two different cupcake toppers. And actually, you could keep manning the hot glue gun. Oh, God. Because I gotta what we've out. got here. <laughs> We'll talk about this really quick. This is a super cute pom-pom rainbow cupcake topper. These are only attached by hot glue, which oh, is your magical tool today. <laughs> so I'm going to lay these down. I've already hot glued them, and we kind of just hot glued them at an angle. And then you literally will just put hot glue on the top of your toothpick and put it into your pom-pom. I can do that. So mom or dad could uh, pre we yes. glue those together, right? Yeah, you so could don't... use tacky glue. If your okay. kids are patient enough, that would be totally fine as well. It just takes more time to dry. And then I'm going to let you work with okay. this Airhead candy, and you can cut it into be a little flag like we've got oh, here. Cute. This is okay. the world's easiest oh, cupcake yeah, I got topper. The, see, I paid, I paid <laughs> Ashley a little money to get me. She gave me the easy, me the easy job yes. here. And, and you just kind of cut it. Yeah, you can just lay it down. That's totally cool. <laughs> and you're cutting this little piece to be kind of flagish, and you just jam a toothpick into your candy. And then you have this really cute, ready to go for St. Patty's Day cupcake topper well, what in do two I do different with forms. What's left? Oh, I'll yeah, eat you it. just enjoy that candy. And here's a little toothpick. You can kind of weave it in there if you want. This again was just at Joanne's on an end cap, oh, and I was that. like, I was looking for that, and so you win. The other really cute you idea you could do is put crafting. it in your yes. You can always Ooh, make like a little a rainbow, whole like, rainbow this, thing right? like that with this magical belt candy. I'm Everyone that. loves rainbows, and that is perfect. See, look, I made that. Yeah, you did, did it. it. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> a plus. Lastly, okay. you'll want to maybe start with this cocktail Absolutely. if you're doing this with friends or you're just like, I don't know about hot glue guns. <laughs> We're going to do the Lucky Leprechaun cocktail. So it's a different take on a white Russian. And so I'm going to let you dump that amount of Lucky Charms into our white bowl because our okay. secret to this 
is combining Lucky Charms with our heavy cream that we're going to use. So you can okay. go ahead and we're dump out, out all here, of that. So. Okay, okay, no problem. We're going to let this infuse with our heavy cream all together <laughs> for 30 minutes. This is going to make your minutes. a taste flavor town. So I'm going to go ahead and make the cocktail. We've got this like bunch of, um, what do you call it, ice? <laughs> We're going to add some Kahlua into there, about an ounce to two ounces. This is going to be a fully loaded one, so just excuse the craziness. We're going to add some vodka into there, and then we're going to top it with our Lucky Charms milk infused cream. And then if you want to get the whipped cream ready, yep. we're so going to top the, that. you took the candy out then? or it, we, Yep, oh, we took okay. the candy oh, out so after 30 minutes of infusing it. Oh, I gotcha. And then this just goes on top? Yep, and then you can top it with Lucky Charms, and then you are oh. done, and you have the world's cutest little cocktail for St. Patty's Day. I love that. I'm just going to take this whole bottle and... Uh, <laughs> really I love it. Great morning. ideas. If you want to see that recipe, we're going to put that up a little bit later yes. as well. But great ideas for the kids and the adults. Happy St. Patty's Day early. Thank you, Ashley Thank and you. Unglued for coming in. We'll be right back.